one's for the lovers. If you're out there, let me hear you say, yeah, 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 yeah. This one's for the lovers. If you're out there, let me hear you say, yeah, 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 yeah. Hey vlog, so this is the result of me putting my wig on and trying to curl it, okay? Clearly was a fucking fail. Um, and I will say it is giving body, very much body yaddy yaddy vibes, but the definition and the curls are completely gone. I did not want that. This is why I would just, I'd rather use flexi rods to curl my hair. The lace is, it's not so bad. I did um, kind of like cut out a baby hair top because I don't, I don't like how that looks. Um, I'm going to put some makeup on it when I start doing my makeup. But the bitch is like, it's so fake. This is what we're looking at, you guys. Um, yeah, I am very disappointed that I've been wasting my time doing it. But, yeah, right now it's like 12 o'clock. Um, I'm probably going to go get me a smoothie somewhere and come back and kind of just get myself together for, oh, yeah. right now in the car i am getting ready to find somewhere to eat really fast um and uh, yeah and then i want to get back home and kind of like do my makeup put myself together for my appointment at three it is going to take me like 30 minutes to get there so i gotta leave my house around like 2 30 and the bag is out of school at two so we're gonna be kind of pushing it but um yeah and she cannot go with me so so i have to make sure i get her back home and then go about my way so
fucking ugly right now but um i just got dressed and i kind of did my makeup you know oh, i'm feeling real horish okay um but i like it. it i really like it because stepping out of your element you know outside of that mommy mode bonnet mode big t-shirt mode okay we're, we're bad bitches we're going into next year bad bitches so i really like it um i am wearing this real cleavage like shirt um and i'm not really doing nothing i'm just going to this consultation but i do want to be a bad bitch so i end up re-gluing down this wig as y'all seen um and y'all seen me like attempt to curl it well i tried but it's still big and poofy but it doesn't look too bad so i'm gonna rock with it um i wish i had a way to kind of prop it all up and show y'all my outfit i don't even have i don't really have a way to prop it guys Here's my outfit. Here's my outfit. Um, I'm wearing this top from Sheen. It's a Pedro Shops. I mean, it's like it. it uh, I can't think of the word. You know what the fuck it's called? It's like pedal shirt. So yeah, it like flares out. And then just these black skinny jeans. Um, I am gonna. God. I am gonna go ahead and put on some heels. What are not here? Just, just like little pumps. So just elevated. The pumps are nude. So yeah, girl. It's just a little some some. I definitely didn't want to do all black. Yeah, here we go. Um. So. Yeah. So I feel so cute. I do feel cute. My closet is so fucking hot. There's no vent in the closet, so it's very hot. But this is what we are working with, you guys. These are my shoes that I'm going to wear. Okay, they did come from Ross. I'm not going to put lotion on my feet because I, like, I need that support of the ash. You know, when the ash is on your feet. Otherwise, when you put lotion on, it's going to just slide down. So... But yeah, you guys, this is kind of what we're working with today. Um, we, I'm waiting on, I'm gonna get back with Nabea. Wanna leave in about like five minutes. So I guess I will see you guys in the car. You guys, we are heading out of the door. Oh my God. Oh my God.
<laughs> so the bitch is out. I have left the place. Let me show you. Okay, cool. Oh. Like... Okay. oh my god. <sighs> bitch. So a bitch has left the center okay i left the elite body sculpture center and girl why they want seventy five hundred dollars why do they want seventy five hundred dollars now i expected a few thousand dollars i ain't even gonna flex my thing was like three bands thirty five hundred dollars that would have been like okay seventy five hundred dollars So, I can't really vlog in there because, for one, the bitches at the front desk, I did not like them. I'm sorry. They were rude. They um, they were gossiping about, like, other fucking situations. Like, it was clear as fuck they were talking about other patients, I'm assuming. Um, they were just snobby and, like, no. Did not like the receptionist at all, all of them. They were all just, like... So, um, I asked them, could I vlog? And they were like, no, you can't vlog in here. You might have to sign some consent form. I just said, okay. So, I come vlog in there. It was a nice little office, though. Give it that. Very nice. Very well decorated. Um, it is a nice office. It is still new. I mean, it's very obvious that the office is still fairly new. But, overall, um, it wasn't so bad. The woman just talked to me. Now, I spoke to one of their, like what you call admissions people like whatever like um nurse i don't know consultation woman but um they told me and they offered me to come back on a monday or tuesday if i actually wanted to talk to the surgeon himself and see kind of what he could do for a girl she did tell me that my situation is very minimal i guess compared to other cases so i'm thinking like yeah you know minimal you know two bands three bands she said six thousand dollars it was six thousand dollars for every for the surgery then there's an additional fifteen hundred dollars for a surgical fee where that kind of like covers your garment your follow-up appointments all of your like like check-ins and met like shit like that downtime is two days it's just the it's the seventy five hundred for me, and then it's the fact that I think it's because this facility offers air sculpt. They don't do traditional lipo, um, which air sculpting I guess is a new thing now. But I don't know. But it did inspire me to hopefully go, you know, meet some other surgeons and just get some insight. I'm not disappointed by my experience. I just feel like not clinically like sound for me to feel confident in doing this. Like she kind of was just giving me like basic rundown shit that I could have got offline. So, um, will I come back? I don't know. But the price is a no no. Like I, I'm just if I'm paying seventy five hundred dollars, y'all need to be putting my body together. That's how I feel. Those are BBL prices, okay? Not no motherfucking chin not just for no little piece of chin nah bitch this is that's too much money i'm gonna have to go across the border that's that's really what's throwing me off but all right you guys i guess i'm gonna see y'all when i get back home am i doing anything else today no nope i ain't doing shit else today no i ain't doing shit else today so i'll probably see y'all when i get back to the house